What's up, Connor High? I'm Isaiah. And I'm Juan. And, and this is Total Recap. Today on Total Recap, we have a few announcements and a new segment called Counselor's Corner. So let's get right into Counselor's Corner with Mrs. Joyner. Hey guys, today I wanted to talk to you about Red Ribbon Week. You know, we don't really do a lot about Red Ribbon Week here at the high school. A lot of the little kids do it, so I wanted to make sure you guys knew about it in case your little brothers and sisters are participating in that. It'll be October 23rd all the way through Halloween, October 31st. And I don't know if you know the history of this particular week, Red Ribbon Week, but it was started to commemorate the life of DEA agent Camarena. He died in 1985. He was actually tortured to death by the drug, the drug cartel. His family and friends started this week to commemorate his life and the service that he did for our country in preventing drugs getting to the youth of America. So that's why people wear the red, it's to commemorate him. And that's where it all started. Um, red Ribbon Week encourages students to understand that you have choices every day and they are impactful to your future. This year's theme is your future is key, so stay drug free. I hope that you consider that when you make your choices every day and that you stay drug free. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Joyner, for that segment. We look forward to seeing more of that. Now let's take a look at some things that are going on here at Connor High. The first announcement for today is that there will be chess club tomorrow in room 163 after school. Chess club meets every other Wednesday if you're interested. Make sure to go check that out. Next, for all those ROTC folks and those who are interested, there will be a homecoming parade in downtown Conroe at 6 p.m. tomorrow. Make sure to come out and support us. If you can't go to that, make sure to make it to this week's pep rally on Friday. Restaurants will be on sale this week during lunch, so make sure to go get them. And for all those couples out there, this Saturday there will be a homecoming dance. Make sure you come by and buy your tickets this week. Next Wednesday, October 24th, the CHS Orchestra will be having a concert in the auditorium from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Make sure you come out and show your support. We also have some college visits coming up in the College and Career Center. First, Lone Star College will be visiting on October 25th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. On the 26th, Texas Tech University will be visiting us as well at 10.15 a.m. And finally, on the 27th, General Chinat Flying Tire Academy, a flight training program will be there at 10.15 a.m. To go to these meetings, make sure to go by the CCC and sign up. You'll be given a pass and will be released at the time of visit. On October 24th, Lone Star's Financial Aid Office will be in the CCC to help families complete the FAFSA. They will be here from 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. On October 26th, university representatives will be here in the CCC during all four lunches to discuss how to apply and be competitive for scholarships and how to navigate the financial aid award process. If anyone needs any more information on college and career readiness, stop by the CCC. Thank you so much for joining us this week for Total Recap. Make sure to follow us at KTIG News on all social media and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Don't forget to tune in to next week's KTIG's Total Recap.